Hello everyone, welcome back to my second channel. I hope you're all having a great day. This of course is my second channel. This is not my main channel. Don't, Don't get, get it twisted. twisted. If you found this video and thought it was my main channel, this is actually my second channel where I like to get a little bit sillier, a little bit wackier, do a little bit less scripted of videos. And I also like to have a LaCroix or two while I'm at it. Today, oh holy shit. <laughs> That, um, got in my eye. Today we're gonna be having a nice, crisp, refreshing lime LaCroix. Mmm. A nice, reliable lime. A lime will never let you down. Today we're gonna be continuing on with our episode story, A YouTuber's Reality. If you didn't watch the first one or you need a quick refresher, I believe what happened in the last one is our girl Mia wants to be a YouTuber. She's worried about what the bullies at school might think. There's also a cute boy in the mix. She posted her first video and it did pretty well. And right as we ended the last episode, she posted her second video, which was sort of like a clickbaity story time video. And it was just starting to pop off as she was going to bed. So we're gonna see what happens in this one. Hopefully my girl starts starts raking in the views, starts making that coin like she's Mario. So let's see what happens. Episode three of eight. It looks like this one is titled <gasps> So, sounds pretty exciting. Oh, also, before we start, if you want to get any of the new merch, such as this ooey gooey yummy yummy tasty little snack shirt, head on over to dannygonzalez.store. Okay, so this is Chloe. I believe this is the author of the episode. Hey guys, I really hope you all enjoy this episode. Like, like, I have said at the end of the past two episodes, the upcoming ones will be much longer. All right, it looks like we're in for a treat. We're gonna get some more juicy, juicy content. Thank you, XX. I'll give you a chance to edit your character. Oh, thank goodness. Maybe, just maybe, I'll actually be able to change her name to Greggy this time. Let's see, Greggy, done. So Greggy, what's your look? You know what, actually now that she's starting to pop off a little bit, maybe I wanna give her a little bit crazier of a hairstyle. Gets a little bit more confident, you know? She's not afraid to explore different options. Sure, I'll say she's gonna shave her head for this one. Just half of it. Maybe if she gets a little bit more famous, she'll shave the whole thing, who knows? What, I've got over a thousand views! She's doing that thing again where she doesn't look at her phone and she just holds it over her head. I think, anyway, I, I can't quite tell because my phone's up there, I'm trying to look, but it's, it's a funny angle. And uh, right off the bat, I see her name is still Mia. It's not Greggy, so I'm starting to think that it will never be Greggy. This is crazy. Yeah, I'm actually, I'm proud of her, man. A thousand views? That, that clickbait will do it, son. I have to call Grace. Grace, I've got over a thousand views on my story time, and I've gained 50 subscribers. I wonder what a good number of subscribers to gain from a thousand views is. I guess, so that would be like one out of every 20 people that saw the video subscribed. I, that's pretty good, I think. That's a pretty respectable. And that means that even though she had kind of a clickbaity title, people that clicked on the video didn't really care because it was an entertaining video anyway, because they were entertained enough to subscribe. So that's pretty good. Yes! Can you believe it? Question mark, exclamation point, question mark, exclamation point, question mark, exclamation point. Okay, I'll talk to you at school. This is actually amazing. I'm late for school! <laughs> I see she's still got those cigarettes on her nightstand. Girl, you gotta quit. That's not good for you. Mia! Yes, mom? What was all that noise, sweetie? I got over a thousand views! On what? <laughs> on my OnlyFans! Yeah, I suppose our mom doesn't even know that we're trying to start a YouTube career yet. This is all gonna be news to her. YouTube! Isn't that a site you buy pets from? Huh? What? Is that- why would YouTube be a site you buy pets from? I guess YouTube kind of has a reputation for having like cat videos. That's a joke that all, all like middle-aged people really like. Oh, YouTube, the video, the site with the cat videos. Cause that used to be a thing in like 2007 and they, do, and they haven't heard anything else about YouTube since 2007. But she doesn't just think it's a site to look at pets. She thinks it's a site to buy them. She must think that the cat videos are like displaying the cat. Like, look how cute my cat is. $700. Um, no, mom. Um, no, mom. It's where you make videos of yourself and post them. Uh, okay, so you're telling me anybody can see these? <laughs> yeah. Do you not know how dangerous that is? Mom, it's fine. Nothing bad is going to happen. If you say so. I'm trying to remember, like, if when I was in high school, if my parents had any qualms with me making YouTube... <laughs> videos. I, knew, I do know we were careful about not ever showing like our address or any of our like really personal information on video. So I suppose my parents uh, were concerned about that. Oh, she said, if you say so. Why does mom not understand? I feel like she did understand. She said, if you say so and walked away. It seems like she's over it now. <laughs> mom, I made YouTube videos and they're doing really well. Isn't that dangerous? No. Okay, if you say so. <sighs> my Dumb bitch of a mom will never understand. Oh shoot, I forgot about my date tonight. Oh yeah. That's right, we have a date with the cute boy whose name I believe is 
Skylar? How did those berries taste? Oh, Leah. If you don't remember, Leah is a bully and we hate Leah. So apparently she saw our video and she thinks it's hilarious that we ate poison berries. So we can either say back off or what are you talking about? Honestly, it didn't even seem like that mean of a thing to say. I feel like that's something a friend could say after they saw your video. They'd be like, hey, I saw your video last night. How, how are those berries? Buddy, that's a... That was a silly story. But instead, my options are back off. Don't ask about my YouTube videos. In fact, don't even watch them. Or I can say, what are you talking about? Like, I have no idea that I made a YouTube video. You know what? Let's play it cool. Let's say, what are you talking about? I found your YouTube channel, dummy. Uh-oh, we look upset. <laughs> Look at how she's standing. She's got her eyes closed. She's so mad. Her jaws clenched. Her fingers are balled up into fists. This girl comes up to you at school and you're just standing there like, like get a clue, Leah. Take a look at our body language. Do we want to be talking to you? I'm going to show the whole school. Do you think Skylar will still want to take you on a date? I don't. I'm confused about what the issue here is like the whole school is gonna make fun of her and Skylar's not gonna want to go on a date with her because in the first grade she ate poison berries that's not even that embarrassing I could understand maybe if you made a YouTube video that was like I pooped my pants yesterday in school did you smell a stinky smell in school yesterday that's because I pooped my pants I could understand that being pretty embarrassing and it might turn some people off of you but like they're in high school now and this was in first grade she ate poison berries anyway maybe I'm defending Mia too much I'm I suppose I'm a bit of a ride or die for Mia but like Leah what the fuck is that even gonna do why are you doing this because I'm allowed to stay away from my man. This is so unfair. I have to jog in place because it's so unfair. <laughs> I'm just so stressed out I gotta blow off some steam right here. Right here in the school hallway. This is so unfair! What's going to happen? Will Mia delete her YouTube channel just as she's getting views? To be continued. Right now. Okay, I was I thought that was gonna be the end of the episode. I was like, that wasn't longer. Will Mia delete her YouTube channel? I hope not. I feel like that would make it seem even more suspicious. Like if there was a rumor going around school that Mia did something embarrassing on her YouTube channel and then people went to go look it up and it was deleted, everyone would be like, oh shit, she did something really embarrassing. And then people would just speculate more and more and the rumors would get worse probably. But I feel like if people just go to her YouTube channel and she's like, I ate berries and they were the wrong berries, people would be like, oh, okay. Yeah, that wasn't that bad. Later on that night. This is not fair. She won't get away with it. I'm gonna show her that I don't care what she thinks. YouTube makes me happy and that's all that matters. Off she goes. And here she comes. Hey guys, I'm back. Okay, I guess she's recording a YouTube video now. So let's see what she's got to say now that the pressure's on. She's got 50 loyal subscribers. She's got a video with 1K. What's this fresh new content gonna be? I started my YouTube account to express myself and make me happy. Some people at my school found my channel and have been really mean about it. I don't even know if, I mean, only one person has found it and she was only kinda mean. So you're being a little bit dramatic, Mia. But you know, I'll let it slide cause you know, this is for the tube. Sometimes you gotta exaggerate on the two. I'm making this video to say, I don't care what you all think. I don't care what anyone thinks. I'm going to keep making videos no matter what. I don't know if that's a, the exact right attitude to have. I would care a little bit what people think because you still want to make videos that are like entertaining to people. If people are like, this, these videos suck, you shouldn't be like, I don't give a shit. I want you to still watch them but I don't care what you think about them. Make things that you want to make for sure, but I think you should take people's input. Um. Except maybe Leah, because she's kind of a, kind of a jerk. Mia continues to talk about her life and how it's getting to her. Thank you. I'll see you all next time. I forgot about my date! <laughs> oh no! Mia! She talked for so long about her life that she forgot about her date. Hey Skylar, can we change our date to tomorrow? I've kind of got some stuff going on. Okay, thanks heaps. I will see you at school tomorrow. Mia's phone began to buzz like crazy. Oh, holy shit. What? I just gained 400 new subscribers. This has to be a record! Um, I'm gonna go out on a limb and say it's not a record to gain 400 subscribers in that short of time but I mean it is it is impressive don't get me wrong I have how did she gain 400 subscribers grace go look at my new video it's completely blown up I know this is crazy okay bye girl I've gained 500 new subscribers is that good yes mom yes mommy oh congrats honey this is amazing I could become famous oh the mom looks so sad <laughs> She's so sad because she doesn't know what any of it means. She's like, I don't know what a subscriber is. I don't know what views is. I don't want you to sell my cat though. I love that cat. And meet Shane Dawson. Oh, not necessarily good timing for this one, huh? I suppose this was 
written a, a while ago. Uh, okay. <laughs> he just doesn't care. I don't know who that is. I don't, and I don't know what any of this means. So just don't. Honestly, just don't talk to me about it anymore. I don't care. Good night, sweetie. I had better get changed and go to bed. Guys, I'm extremely sorry, but I have to cut this episode short. Oh no! What? What happened to the longer episodes? I may edit it and make it longer, but I need to get these three episodes made to publish my story. Next episode will be out within the next couple of days. Bye, guys. Well, I'm honestly a little bit disappointed about the length of that episode, but I gotta be honest, I am on the edge of my seat. Hey guys, I know I stopped making chapters, and I'm so sorry. Uh-oh. Was there like a significant gap between these episodes? I'm going to start a youtubers reality up again, and it's going to be better than ever I also made an Instagram page follow it to keep updated and you can also message me any requests, etc A Y R episode. So if you want to follow the creator of this story on Instagram Hit her up now. Here's the chance to edit your character, but remember your name will stay as Mia Okay, at least she says it this time and admits it your name will always be Mia. Just remember that. So what's your name? I guess it's Mia. The next day. Ugh, I barely slept last night. Must have been all the excitement from actually gaining subscribers. Oh well, I better get ready for the day. Oh, I forgot. We had school uniforms introduced. Great. Huh? Did that happen? Did we know about that? I feel like that was- I, I don't remember them mentioning that. Oh well, I don't have a choice. Oh, so now we gotta wear this lame-ass uniform and I can't get- I don't get to pick what she wears to school? Lame. I wonder if Skylar would want to do that date tonight. I better hurry up and get to school. Hey, Grace. Oh, hey. I still can't get over how many views I've got. Yeah, Mia, I get it. Oh, shit. Someone's jealous? Yeah, she's probably upset that she didn't get in on the shit on the ground floor. She said she didn't really want to help with the channel, and now look at her. She doesn't get to reap the, all the rewards. She's not rolling in the clout like us, baby. 500 subs? All you talk about is subscribers and videos. I miss the old days, Mia. Well, I'm sorry, Grace, but I'm excited. As we should be. Fuck Grace. Hashtag fuck Grace. Trying to take away our moment? Also, it's only been like two days. So, like, it's not like all we talk about anymore. It's just been two days because it's been some crazy shit happening, Grace. Yep. Oh, and there she goes. Wow, shit. What is going on with her? Honestly, I hate to say it, but I think Grace is a toxic friend. I think Mia deserves better. If I ever get an option to pursue a new friendship, you better believe I'm gonna pick that. Mia, hey! <laughs> oh, great, it's Skylar. Oh, hey, Skylar. So, we still need to have that date. Oh yeah, for sure. How does tonight sound? Tonight sounds great or tonight's not great. I would like to go on the date with Skylar, don't get me wrong, but I'm also a little bit skeptical that these choices even do anything, and I feel like we're gonna go on the date with Skylar no matter what I say. So to test my hypothesis, I'm just gonna say that tonight's not great and see what happens. Tonight's not great. What? I thought you were into me! <laughs> He's like pissed. What the fuck? I thought you were into me. I thought I was I thought you thought I was hot as hell. Well, you thought wrong. Oh shit. Maybe I'm really not gonna go on a date with uh, did I just ruin my chances with Skylar? The hottest hubba hubba hunk in school? Oh wow. It doesn't really matter what you say. We are going on this date. Oh. What? <laughs> it doesn't matter what you say. We're going! I'm gonna handcuff you and put and put you in my car myself if I have to, but we're going on the date. Ha ha ha, what, did I just laugh? Well, at least one good thing has happened today. See, I d n none of the, none of my choices make a difference. Is this a choose your own adventure game? Or a just wish your own adventure game? Like it gives you an option and you're like, I wish I could do that. And the game's like, well, too bad, you're going. Oh shit, now we're eating pizza. So I heard you're going on a date with Skylar, said Leah. You already knew that, Leah, cause we already, uh, we already confronted each other about this. Uh. Well, yes. No, you're not. Or else your little YouTube channel gets exposed to the whole school. This shit again, Leah, we already we already talked about this, and I already honestly made a whole ass video about why I don't give a shit. You wouldn't. Oh, I would. What am I going to do? Well, I thought we were over this, Mia. What happened? We just, I, the last episode just ended with you making a whole video about like, I don't care what anyone thinks. And now all of a sudden she's like, I care the most about what everyone thinks. What will happen on a YouTuber reality next time? Time. Also guys, I'm sorry for the episode being so short. I just wanted to get one up so everyone knew I was continuing the story. Damn, I, f I feel for this girl. She's like every every time she wants to make the next episode longer and then something happens. This one, I feel like this one was the shortest one yet and we were promised a nice long juicy episode. Don't forget to follow the Insta page. Okay, for episode five, the description is Mia gets threatened. 
Will she pick YouTube or Skylar? Uh oh. Who's gonna threaten her? Next day at school, Leah's like, I'm gonna, I'm gonna kidnap your mom and throw her off a bridge unless you leave Skylar alone. Hey guys, welcome back. Don't forget to follow AYR Insta's page, AYR episode. Also, if you would like to see yourself in my story, DM on Insta and you may have a chance to be. Okay, hold the phone. I'm sorry, I know this is supposed to be just a video about episode, but I really want to get in this story. I didn't realize this was an option, so now I. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do this real quick. AYR episode, is that what it was? Huh? Uh, I'm sorry? This person does not exist? How long ago was this published? Did he, did she delete her Instagram? Hey! Chloe, put me in the story, please. I want to be in it. I could be, I, I could be in it as myself. I could give Mia some advice, maybe, in the story. It'd be cool. Instead of meeting Shane Dawson, she could meet me. Shit, man. I missed my chance now. All right, later on at home. What am I going to do? I really like Skylar, but I also like making videos. What am I going to pick? YouTube or Skylar? Uh, my passion or a boy that I barely know? Um, Skylar. I'm picking Skylar. I'll never meet anybody like him again. I love him. Oh, okay. Well, hold your horses. I don't know about that. It's settled. I'll make one more video, then I'll call Skylar. This is clearly both options. I'm gonna make one more video and then call Skylar. So we're doing both. I'll film outside. There's good lighting right now. Whoa, shit. What is this new camera? She was filming on her phone in the last episode. Now she's got like a cinema camera. Holy AdSense must be good on the <laughs> couple thousand views that she got. Mia makes her video. I guess, what? That was weird. She like was under the camera making the video. Thanks for reading guys. Please leave feedback. Bye. These episodes are getting shorter and shorter. This, okay. We're gonna do one more episode and this better be a longer episode. This episode, Mia must decide what she wants. YouTube or Skylar. I feel like we already decided that we're gonna do both. Okay, that's done. I have to edit. This video is going to take forever to edit. Mia edits her video. Finally, I'm done. Okay, so they just skimmed right over that. Oh, this is gonna take forever. I'm done. I need food. Hey, wait, isn't she supposed to call Skylar? Aren't they supposed to go on a date tonight? Isn't she supposed to get kidnapped by Skylar later tonight? What should I eat? Pizza or nothing? I'm not really that hungry. Well, she said I need food. So I'm gonna say nothing. I'm not really that hungry. I should probably get to bed. No, Mia. Oh my God, Mia, I'm trying. Look, I'm trying to help you. I, I didn't want you to eat anything because I wanted you to remember that you're supposed to call Skylar. Remember? The love of your life, apparently? <laughs> I better post my video. It may be my last one. I don't know why it's gonna be your last one. Are you gonna starve to death because you didn't eat anything? Buzz, buzz. Oh, I thought she said that. <laughs> but I think that's her phone going buzz, buzz. Hey, it's Skylar. Are you ready? I'll be there in five. Shoot, I forgot about the date! I mean, if this does if this isn't the very essence of Mia, I don't know what is. Filming YouTube videos and forgetting about dates. That's what Mia, that's what Mia does. Hey Skylar, I'll meet you out front. I'll explain my situation to him while we're on our date, I guess. I'd like to wear something flirty, something comfortable, or what I have on. Uh, you know what? I'm trying to get my mans. Let's do something flirty. Ooh, it is flirty. Look at that. I love this look. I'll catch the eye of someone cute. Probably Skylar. I would assume. Skylar? Eh, this will do. <laughs> He's like, oh, I love it, I love it, it's perfect. Meh, meh, it'll do. In the car. We're walking in the car. You know, sometimes you just walk through the car. So where are we going? Also, they're standing in the car too. <laughs> He's got the steering wheel down here, just driving. Beautiful evening, huh? Skylar, if I knew we were coming to the beach, I would have brought my swimmers. I assume whatever country the, the person who wrote this in calls like swimsuit swimmers. Either that or she's like, I got I got Michael Phelps back home. I would have brought him if I knew we were coming to the beach. I like that sandcastle in the background. I wonder if Skylar made that. He's like, I wanted to, I just wanted to show you my sandcastle. It's pretty sick, right? All right, we can go home now. I just wanted to watch the sunset with you. It's beautiful, just like you. Oh, thanks. You're beautiful too. Oh gosh, why did I say that? What I meant to say was, I think you're pretty great. Well, thanks, Mia. Uh-oh. Did Mia forget about Leah's threat? How will Mia's new video affect her channel? Find out next time on a YouTuber's reality. Also, don't forget to follow the Insta page AYR episode. I wish I could, Chloe. I really do wish I could. But unfortunately for me, it does not exist. If somehow you see this video, please put me in your story. I wanna be in the story. I wanna be a YouTuber in the story. All right, well, that's probably enough episode for today. But you know what that means? Now it's time to talk about our sponsor, HelloFresh. Do you wanna spend less time grocery shopping and more time enjoying delicious home-cooked meals? Well, then I got a great little sponsor for you. HelloFresh is America's number 
number one meal kit. If you sign up to HelloFresh like I have, they'll send you three delicious meals every week. It's a variety of recipes. You get to try something new every week. It cuts out the stress and time of grocery shopping because they send you all of the ingredients plus the recipe. You get to spend less time stressing about cooking because it usually only takes about 30 minutes to cook each meal. Because HelloFresh pre-portions all the food for you and only sends you the food that you'll need for each recipe, you spend less time prepping each meal and you also waste less food. You pretty much don't waste any food because you use all of the food that you will need for the recipe in the recipe and you don't end up with like a whole extra bushel of broccoli or something that you're not going to use and you're going to forget about and it's just going to sit in your fridge. And on top of wasting less food, HelloFresh is also a lot more sustainable than grocery shopping. HelloFresh's carbon footprint is like 25% less than grocery store meals and the packaging that HelloFresh comes in is almost entirely recyclable. You can easily change delivery preferences, change the day of the week you want the meals to come. You can even add more meals or lunches and all around it just makes cooking dinner a more enjoyable experience. So if you want to take some of the stress out of grocery shopping, meal prepping, cooking, and put more of the enjoyment into eating, then use my code DannyGonzalez80 to get $80 off your first box plus free shipping with purchase. Go to HelloFresh.com to redeem and for more details. Again, that's DannyGonzalez80 for $80 off your first box with purchase. Thank you to HelloFresh for sponsoring this video, and thank you to you guys for checking out HelloFresh. All right, well, that's the end of the video.